Is there anybody hiding there in the dark? Nothing like a good warm-up when you're on a case, you know? Tell me, which switch did you use to turn on the LEDs? The light switch, sir. Yeah. Strange, it didn't work for me. Ah. Yes. Unless I miss my guess, this would be the uh, gymnasium room, eh? I guess. Uh... Yes. It is a good room. Oh. Yes. Uh, this reminds me of my younger days at the Sûreté Peace Academy. The parallel bars, my speciality. I was something of an athlete, you know. Yes, yes. I was known as the Pavlova of the parallels. Uh, yes. Oh, coming back now. <laughs> ah, yes, I remember. Ah! Ah! Oh. Well, that felt good. <laughs> well, now, I expect you're all wondering why I ask you here. <laughs> I know, I know. Now, um, yes, as I was saying, um... You were saying you supposed we were all uh, wondering, wondering if why you called yeah. us Look, here. there is no need for you to speak unless I ask you a question. What is your name? I'm Shawk, the gardener. And what is it you do? I'm the gardener. Then why didn't you say that to me in the first place? I did. Look, don't try to be funny with me, monsieur. This is a very serious matter, and everyone in this room is under the suspicions. Room? What? What was that? You said room. Yes, I know that. And there was a very good chance that someone in this room knows more about the murder than he is telling. Murder? What was that you said? I said murder. What murder? Well, I don't know. You said murder. I said murder? You said murder. No, I said murder because you said murder. I said murder! You said there was someone in this room who knew more about the murder than he's telling. Now listen. What was your name? Shawk. The cook. Gardener. Ah! Now we are getting somewhere. You! Oh dear! Yeah. Yeah. Are you all right, Mr. Stutterstaff? Uh, who is this man? He's Mr. Stutterstaff. I see him. What is your job, Mr. Stutterstaff? He's the beekeeper. I'm not asking you. I'm asking Mr. Stutterstaff. What's that? What is he saying to you? What? What, what was that? <laughs> He says he's got a bit of a cold and he's lost his voice. Lost his voice? A beekeeper who has lost his voice, a cook who thinks he's a gardener, and a witness to murder. Oh, yes. It is obvious to my trained eye that there is much more going on here than meets the ear. Before you are dismissed, Mr. Stiff Sticker, I suggest you count your bees. You may find that one of them is missing. You broke the piano! What is the price of one piano compared to the terrible crime that has been committed here? But that's a priceless Steinway. Not anymore. What is your name? Mrs. Lever, Lily. Mrs. Lovelever, 
I would take a shrewd guess that you are the housekeeper, am I right? I have been with Professor Fassbender for 30 years. That would account for your exaggerated hysteria over a simple blemish on the furniture. Blemish? Whatever has happened to the piano can easily be repaired. What has happened to Professor Fassbender and his daughter is another matter. And it is my job to bring the guilty party or parties uh, to the justice. Now then, what do we need? One, that Professor Fassbinder and his daughter have been kidnapped. Two, that someone has kidnapped them. Three, that my hand is on fire. Sir, huh? uh, uh, Inspector Clouseau has been uh, ah. interrogating the staff. Uh, uh, Inspector Clouseau, uh, Superintendent Quinlan. Oh, Inspector. Uh, Superintendent. <laughs> oh, yes, I'm going to kill you. 